Okay, can you introduce yourself? I'm Sarah Sturm. <laughs> Amazing, thank you for being here with us. <laughs> um, how are you feeling for Leadville? Oh, um, I feel pretty pumped. I like am always sort of like looking forward slash dreading this race, but this year I feel like pretty pumped to like get to use all the training that I've put in the last month. So I'm actually pretty excited. Awesome. And how many times have you raced it before? Four. Or wait, three. <laughs> wow. Um, what are you most excited for on the course since you know it? Oh gosh I actually really like the climb up to Columbine so I know that's like so dumb to say but I do really love it I'm ready I honestly I'm ready for the start to be done like I'm ready to like be at the start line the like whistle to go off and like finally be started because then all the nerves go away yeah because yeah, then you just have to like ride your bike and finish so yeah this is like the worst part of everything right yeah. it's like the anticipation <laughs> yeah um are you more of a sweet or salty person Oh my gosh. Well, I actually have been trying to do fewer desserts. This is how I'm like seriously preparing for Lego. So I used to be a sweet girl, but now I think I'm a salty girl in so many ways. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. Um, are you more of a cat or dog person? Oh, dog. Dog for sure. Um, what are three things that you can't bike without? A helmet. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Lame answer. <laughs> that's a good, I mean, that is a good answer. You do need that. Gosh. Honestly, sunglasses, also very lame. I'm getting old and I'm like, oh my God, my vision is really important. And then snacks. snacks yeah. <laughs> What's your favorite snack from the feed? Oh my God. Uh, God. I actually really like those Sturker, Stiker. Yeah. Sturker. Sturker. I love, love the bars. The name is challenging for me. Sturker. It's because I'm not British. <laughs> I love those, the bars that they make. Mm -hmm. It's like what I want like Rice Krispies to taste like. Yeah. They're so good. Those are really good. I like to snack none on them in the office. <laughs> yeah, totally. Um, Barbie or Oppenheimer? Wait, what? Barbie or Oppenheimer? Oh, Barbie, obviously. <laughs> oh, Which, I mean, I'm from New Mexico, so like Barbie's a big answer, but Barbie, for yeah. sure. Greta Gerwig all the way. Oh my God, that was amazing. <laughs> My dog's name is Greta. No! Like, yeah. <laughs> we are like, oh, Greta Gerwig. <laughs> Look what you did. You did I a love great Greta. job. <laughs> um, do you listen to music when you bike? Yes. What's your favorite song to listen to right now? Oh my god. I am on like a heavy metal phase right now, to be honest. Um, I always am like, I can, I'm like a go to fuzz. Um, I'm trying to think of like my, honestly, any album of theirs I'm like into. Awesome. Yeah. Maybe I'll add that to my running playlist. That's good. Um, and who do you think your biggest competition out there is? I guess Fuzz is more psychedelic rock. Sorry. <laughs> Good clarification. Um, honestly, I'll, I always have my eyes on Sophia. She's, you know, friend and yeah. probably my strongest competitor because we know each other pretty well. And I know she had like a pretty bad day here last year, but Sophia is the type of person to like not repeat a bad day. So. She's definitely on my watch list. Um, there's also a couple other little night, or night horse, dark horses. Sorry, there's a lake in Durango called Night Horse um, that I think could be like little sneakers. Um, yeah, but probably Sophia. Cool. Are you going to win tomorrow? Gosh, I sure hope so. I've gotten all the other places. First is on the list. <laughs> well, good luck, and we'll see you out there. Thanks. <laughs>